Well, 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 of course, y'all see who he is. <laughs> y'all know he is the man with the plan. This is what it is. He's down here helping out his big sister once again. Once again. I could not <laughs> get how to get me some little coins mm -hmm. from my little TikTok. So sure. he had to come down here and get me all the way together. That's exactly what he does. <laughs> he is a man of many talents. And so um, for those that don't know, I know everybody in Dayton. <laughs> we know who this is, but I want you to go ahead and tell them who you are, Peanut. Yes, yeah, so, so my name is Peanut Professionally. My grandmother always to the mayor called me Peanut, so it's not like I'm saying Peanut to try to be deceptive. My real name is Curtis. I have a book right now on Amazon called Dash Resource Five Step Beginners Edition. I literally started from the corner of my apartment teaching people how to invest in stock on Facebook. And it came from me doing it every single Sunday to the point where people would ask me to type it over and over and over again to the point where I just compiled it into a book that made it easier on people for them just to have it anywhere. So you get it on Amazon right now called Dash Resource, Five Step Beginners Edition. Um, so yeah, um, I'm here talking about stocks today. But like she said before, I'm a bit of a renaissance man myself. I do a lot of different things when it comes to acting or author. Like I said before, I run a, a small business incubator. Um, called Official Network and Chill, where me and my three other business partners, we help the community uh, when, it, when it comes to inspiration, when it comes to art, when it comes to finances, when it comes to connections. We handle all of that for them. Yes, and that's for someone that is currently looking to try to start up a business. Uh, Network and Chill is definitely the place to be on Mondays. Mm -hmm. Yes. yes. Mondays are only for official network and chill. That's the only reason we, the only reason Monday exists for network and chill. <laughs> yeah. Now, but no, for real though, at one time I mean, I graduated. So am I mm -hmm. alumni? Yes. Right now? Yes. You are definitely so alumni. I am an yeah. alumni now. Yes. I, um, I did not finish school. So, um, that was one of the first things that I literally, uh, completed and got my plaque for it. And I was so excited Mm -hmm. about that that i i you know i finished something i would always start something and do great at it but i never finished yeah we're so, so proud of yes you yes so i've been i've been running the course ever since mm -hmm. so okay so peanut i call peanut down here today of course he always helped me with personal things but mm -hmm. i i text him because i've been following this particular man i can't think of his name right now i got oh, yeah, wrote you, down you, you send his name to me uh okay is that going to, uh i can find that in two seconds okay Carl Iken. Carl, yes, that's him. Carl Iken. Mm -hmm. So I was actually, I don't know how he, I was looking at one thing on YouTube of mm -hmm. inspiration or some somehow or another he came on there. Yeah. So I end up just binge watching this man, and I, it was so inspiring to me. Mm -hmm. Like I'm saying, wait a minute, I'm talking. This is the stuff that Peanut literally is teaching everybody yes. for free. I mean, of yes. course he had other things he was talking about, mm -hmm. but I'm saying. The groundwork of it all is what you teach us for nothing, and yes. he believes the same thing. He well, believes yeah. in that, but he's um, but he was kind of shrewd as far as getting that money, though. But <laughs> I mean, he still he learned at a very early age mm -hmm. on how to do it. So mm -hmm. anyway, I was looking at that, and I he was saying some things that kind of reminded me of what you were saying to us. So I know with stocks, you had told me when I first met you that if you're going to do that, you maybe you should try to invest in something that you constantly use, something you constantly are paying for, anything that are like annoyances to you. Like if you're saying, oh my God, I spent all this money on Amazon, you should own Amazon stock. Oh my God, I spent all this money on gas. What gas station is it? Is it BP? Is it Shell? Mm. Um, BP is, is British Petroleum. It's a stock. Shell is a stock. Uh, Amazon's a stock, so you came across this other one, which been annoying the whole world with these little orange boxes out all over the oh, place. Oh God, yes, Timu. Yes. And so I said, I just think that is the greatest little app ever. The cutest yes. earrings, glad those glasses that everybody keeps telling me about. I'm yes. literally got that for two dollars and eighty five cents, yes. and they fly. Mm -hmm. I'm talking about brothers were stopping me. Brothers were stopping me like, "Lady, your glasses is fly." I yeah. told them the same thing. You know me, I'm not perked out. Got it from Timu, two dollars. I said, "What?" I said, "I'm not lying." Yeah. So I'm learning uh, just about that. So I said, oh, this, I said, you know what? I'm going to call you and ask you. So what is the stock thing with Timu? Like so so Timu is owned by a stock called PDD. Um, what's the other part? PDD Holdings. So PDD Holdings owns multiple different companies as well. It's not just Timu they own. Mm -hmm. Think of it like uh, how uh, Google owns Google phones. They own multiple different things. But, okay. like, but like they're based out of China. So, um, um, like, this whole thing about the whole dollar dominance is falling. I'm pretty sure you heard the whole thing about the BRICS. Yes. Uh, which is uh, Brazil, Russia, India, China, and South America are coming together to try to weaken the U.S. dollar. That's right. And 
what I kept telling people was to not be fearful of it because we can make money within it because they're going to be Chinese businesses that are going to be on the stock market. And again, Pina was right. Okay, you call it P Nostradamus at this point because <laughs> <laughs> I always got to have at least one fun in anything I'm talking oh about. God. Because you got to think about it, right? When you have competition, it lowers the price of things, right? For instance, if the only place you could get Though those beautiful glasses was a boutique, then they could charge you two hundred dollars for those glasses. That's right. So when you have different places where you can get it for a cheaper price, it it, it lowers the price of everything else here, mm -hmm. especially in America. I mean, um, the other day I'm in AutoZone with my uh, bro, and we was looking at something that like goes on our car. He was like, "Man, fifty dollars." He said the same exact thing. Man, I get on Timu for two dollars. Same exact thing. Literally, and that's because we are now empowering other places to be competition with us we're going to bring down the ultimate price because i'm telling you if that sits on AutoZone shelf for so long they've had to break bring the price down mm -hmm. so it is good to have competition i'm telling you right now i'm for the bricks right mm -hmm. yes make a big powerhouse to make it to where america can't just say i'm the biggest swinging thing in town and you got to get with it or, or get lost that is that. That's why I have to get you on the interview because there's so many questions I have that I think so many other people mm -hmm. um, have the same questions as myself. It's mm -hmm. just, especially a lot of my female friends yes. that we don't really know. You know, I'm mm -hmm. not saying that it's all me and no, but I know right. a lot of my women friends. They just female friends. They just don't know. And I is, but the way you, it's so simple. The way you break it down, mm -hmm. you just have a teaching spirit, and that, mm -hmm. and it makes people comfortable. And and I'm telling them that you're trustworthy because I don't trust no damn body. <laughs> no. Not when it comes to my money, and I'm I just Bruh. don't, uh, and I'm not lying. I, I got access to everything. She doesn't see yes. every single thing. And everything. Like I said, I've only been yeah. And she and, yeah. and first off, let's just make this clear: he doesn't need my little chips. <laughs> let, let me just make that perfectly clear. Respectfully. So I mean, real, for real, respectfully, he doesn't need it. So he's not even thinking about it. And I, I mean, you know what I'm saying? And he's just trustworthy. So I would like y'all shout yeah. out your thing, okay, real quick, because we got to go to live on Facebook. And if yeah. you guys want to hear more. Of it, then you guys have to go to Facebook real quick. Yes, uh, please, please make sure you log on to my YouTube Dash Resource. You can find me at Dash Resource everywhere. TikTok, I'm on there, but on there, that's my burner account. I just put funny stuff on there. Yes, um, I love I'm, it. I'm also Dash Resource on Instagram. You can Google Dash Resource literally. That's not one of those flexes. You can Google me. I have a uh, actual Google reviews and things of that nature, all five stars. So yeah, just hit me up. Um, you can easily email me at dapper at dash resource .com or dash resource at gmail dot com. Thank you so much. I think this is going to be very informative. I'm trying to tell y'all. If you want to get into that, um, he he breaks it down. Mm -hmm. He'll also meet with you. He's um he's very approachable. Mm -hmm. And you get with him on possibly on Tuesdays. Yes. They, they can um, get with you on a on a one-on-one -on -one yes, sort of kind yes, of, right? I'll, yeah. Any day but Monday, we can work something out. All right. All right. Thank you so mm -hmm. much for sharing that with us. And you know I love you, little brother. Love you too. Thank you.